iTorial Intelligent Tutorials Microsoft Word 2007 Sorting the Rows of a Table This is a continuation of the Select and Format the Header Row of a Table tutorial. Step 1. Make sure the insertion point is somewhere in the table and then click Table Tools Layout tab. Step 2. In the table group, click the Select button and then click Select Table. The entire table is selected. Step 3. In the data group, click the Sort button. The Sort dialog box opens. By default, the far left column heading, Menu Item, is already selected in the Sort by List box. This tells Word to sort the rows of the table according to the contents of the menu item column. Word recognizes the information in the menu item column as text, so text is selected by default in the Type List box. If the column contained dates or numbers, you would see date or number in the Type List box instead. The Sending Option button next to the Sort by List box is selected by default, indicating that Word will sort the contents of the item column from A to Z. The Header Row Option button is selected in the lower left corner of the dialog box. This indicates that the table contains a header row that should not be sorted along with the rest of the rows. The default setting in the Sort dialog box are all correct so you can go ahead and complete the sort process. Step 5. Click anywhere in the table to deselect it. Rows 2 through 5 are now arranged alphabetically according to the text in the menu item column, with the soda row now at the bottom. When you sort a table, all the items in a row move together as one entity. In this table, that means the price will not be separated from the menu items. Also note that the header row remains in its original position at the top of the table. Alright, this looks a little funny. So, let's control Z this, undo this sort, and let's sort by price. We actually just had an update on the soda as well. Soda is now $1.59. Now let's try and sort price by highest amount to lowest amount. All right, that looks better. Nice work. You've now learned to sort alphabetically and also from highest to lowest price. That's all for this tutorial. Thanks for watching, and we hope to see you at another iTorial tutorial sometime soon.